Okay, so I know quite a bit of people are huge fans and have been wanting me to cover the Power Rangers trailer. I used to be a huge, huge Power Ranger fan, like when I was a kid, okay? The original Morphers, the original Power Rangers, you know, you had Tommy, you had uh, you had the original cast, you had the original cast. <clears throat> I remember watching, what was it like ooze or something of the ooze i remember watching that in the theater like i was a huge power ranger fan I had all the toys i had the shirts and the blah 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 and then i fell off because i grew up <laughs> I, I grew up and i didn't i felt like this is wasn't uh, uh i'm done I, I grew out of it honestly but people are still fans of power rangers that's fine i mean power rangers is still entertaining to a lot of people and i understand that so the film i know they wanted this the short film came out about the the R-rated version of Power Rangers. And the studio wanted to make some, something similar like that, but yet keep the tone of kid-friendly, or at least teenage-friendly. I didn't know what to expect from this trailer. I didn't know what to expect from the film. Honestly, maybe I did think like it was not going to do very good. Watching the trailer doesn't necessarily mean it's going to be good, doesn't necessarily mean it's going to be bad. You could just have expectations heading into the film. My expectations for the Power Rangers film is kind of high. I thought it was a great trailer, a great... It looks really good. It looks good. It interests me. It makes me want to go watch it. Here's the thing, though. I don't think they're going to become Power Rangers until the end of the second act. I think it's going to be mostly getting to know these characters, getting to know their powers, and then finally understanding what these powers mean and then going to the big finale of the fight that's when we'll see them in their suits <coughs> so they're going to play it like an episode where a lot of the times it's just more of the interactions and then at the end you're going to see the big battle the big boss battle um i like the cast i think the cast looks great i think the acting i didn't see no uh, moments of the acting it looks uh it looks like they want to put some humor into there as well they don't want to go too dark on this thing uh, I think it looks good. I think it looks really good. I think it reminds me a lot of Chronicle. It looks very independent. Yeah, it looks like it does have a little bit of a budget on it. Um, it but it does remind me of Chronicle, especially with the kid aspects and stuff. The only thing I really have to complain is, like, the bullying. Again, like, every fucking movie has to have somebody who gets bullied. Maybe because I've never gotten bullied, and my... Uh, Everywhere I went to in school, nobody really has got, like in high school, nobody ever got fucking bullied, you know. Uh, there was fights, but it wasn't bullying. It was most likely, you know, motherfucker, you're going to step on my turf, I'm going to step on yours. Um, it's not, not gangster like that, but I'm just saying. Um, it, it looks, it looks... It looks very promising, I gotta say. I mean, the the way... I love, I love this idea. I love them going and finding... I think it was like the... It looked like crystals. It looked like crystals. I have to rewatch it again. But it looked like crystals. But it's not crystals. I think it's the Morpher. <laughs> or no, I think it was some somewhat like crystals. And they get trans that that transfers that power into them. So they're superhuman. They become superheroes. They are superhuman. Uh, best example is when the kid tries to freaking headbutt the other kid. The yeah, he tries to headbutt the other kid. And he, he just, it's like he headbutted a wall and he goes crashing down as one of the bullies. So that's a great example of what they are now and how they look normal on the outside. But in the inside, something happened where they're, they're above human capacity. They're, they're superheroes. They're super soldiers, so to speak. So it was like Captain America, you know, but he bulked up and everything where everybody else looks the same, but uh, he gained all his ability. So I really like that aspect to it. <coughs> um, I really do like, I don't know about the, <coughs> Kimberly and uh, Jason, huh? The relationship right there. I want to see the Green Ranger, but I'm pretty sure they're saving the Green Ranger for the second film because I think this, this film's going to do good no matter what. I think people, if it's Power Rangers on it, they're gonna it's gonna do no matter what. Especially if something like the look of this, people are still gonna go watch. Now gonna go watch it. It's not so kid kitty kitty that teenagers are not gonna go watch it. Teenagers are actually gonna be like, you know, that I had that nostalgia feeling. You know, maybe I'll go check it out. Maybe it'll be good, as good as that short film I saw. So I mean, I think I think Power Rangers the trailer 
is a lot is going for it. It looks great. The cast looks good. Uh, there wasn't really any action sequences at this point because you know they're. I think they want you to get to know these characters first. Um, Elvira is it Elvira? I believe that's her name. I can't. It's been so long. She looks great. She looks really, really good. Actually, she looks better. <laughs> she doesn't look cartoony or anything like. She looks very uh, le- legit. I do like the line she gives. Like I've killed rangers like you before. Um, so I ain't kid friendly right there, huh? So I I just really feel like the Power Ranger trailer really got my hopes up, and I really am looking forward to watching this film and to see if it's really good or not. My expectations are a little bit high on this because I. I I didn't expect that trailer to be that great, and it was really good. And uh, I really, the jumping over the cliff scene was a little iffy, though. But we'll see how that how that all started. So, thank you guys for listening. I'm Dan Megan Dan's son. Be sure to subscribe. Would really appreciate it. Like the video if you like it. And if you are a big fan of Power Rangers, I would love to hear your story down below in the comment section, and I will respond. Thank you, and go go Power Rangers.